。根據最新嘅人口調查，六十五歲以上嘅美國人佔全國總人口嘅百分之十三點一。喺一九四六到一九六四年期間出生嘅美國嬰兒潮人數大約係七千六百萬人，佢哋從二零一一年開始逐漸邁入六十五歲嘅退休年齡。但系从二零零八年以嚟，美国陷入经济危机，唔单止冲击社会福利资金，仲使到青壮年遭遇失去住屋同埋工作嘅双重打击。A huge aging portion of people who will increasingly need medical attention. 喺重重嘅挑战当中，美国应该系点样面对高龄化社会咧？好多人认为公共医疗保险最为关键。Well, I think we need to come up with better a better healthcare system to address the needs of the elderly. Um, they 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 need a lot more care and attention at that age, and I'm not sure we've done a Very good job of dealing with that so far. Well, it's going to be an economic challenge, and that's why I think it's so important to have、um, to have some kind of universal healthcare system in place, so that the cost is distributed more. Well, we obviously have to、uh, deal with healthcare costs, and that's a very complicated problem.、Uh, currently, they're not really doing much. And、uh, that's too bad. Your,、uh, medical checkup routinely, right? The routine checkup. Routine. I don't. I don't usually have one too much.、Uh. Oh, that's really good. How do you take care of yourself? You look so healthy. Well, I, I drink a lot of bourbon. <laughs> If I had to pay one or two percent more in taxes, but I knew that that was making sure that not only me and my family, but that my neighbors and anyone in America could have health care, I would pay into that system. The Americans could. Take a look at Germany. How the public health insurance system of Germany works, and it works. It really works. The people go to a doctor. They have some kind the right to go to a doctor, and that's what America needs. How about your parents taking up their medical expenses? The government.、Um, my mom is in public health insurance, and almost everything is covered. Not everything, but almost everything. So my mom, she's in her 70s now, and she's doing quite well with it. So if the government is covering you, then you,、yeah. you have less to worry about, even for your parents. Exactly. <laughs> And a problem now is that younger people are often, like my daughter, entrepreneurial, and they're having to put everything into their business, and they're not saving money, or they're not, well, not even having health coverage plans. So that's a challenge in itself. Do you think you might rely on your children? <sighs> oh Lord, I hope I don't have to, but.、Um... You know, I would hope that they would do whatever they can. Are you ready for your own retirement? Probably in a couple of years. I I am not probably as ready as I should be.、Um, I have a savings. I'm married to、uh, my husband was、uh, with civil service, so he's got a pretty decent retirement. So my retirement plan is. 除咗医疗保险之外，仲有人关心临终照护嘅问题。Uh, all sorts of.、Uh... You know, issues get very politicized, and including the whole thing about death panels,、uh, which came up when the, with the health care law,、um, which really was、uh, just an over dramatization of,、uh, you know, having people think a little bit about their end of life care, which is an important issue. 唔少人相信扩大青壮年阶层系解决人口老年化嘅方式之一。But it really is a function of immigration and you know, other things, so I think that they'll work their way through it. What do you mean by this function of immigration? Well,、uh, who are young and are starting businesses and doing things, it somewhat、uh, makes up for the fact that the population is aging. Society should、uh, incentive people to、uh, older people to have sons and daughters. The government needs、uh, taxes from all the young people that work in order to cover for expenses of the older older ones. Masa, masa. 呢一群只有十五到十七岁嘅少女，从世界各地嚟到美国做交换学生，佢哋愿意承担照顾父母嘅责任。Think, uh, first, we need to give them love, and we need to take care about them, giving them like,、uh, we need to give them time, we need to care about them because, but we need time to care about them, and I think they need to live with us, not just put in a house for old people, you know. I think I definitely want to like help them with. 
when they need help, like because they support me so much. So we owe that to them. Will you welcome them to live with you in the future? I think so, yeah. If I have a big house. <laughs> <laughs> and how about you? I want to give them back what they did for me. So they, I can, they can appreciate that they have me as a daughter.